Hello, Leo. Welcome to your love reading for August. I'm going to take a look at you, look at your person. For those of you who are single, uh, we'll have a portion for you as well. We'll see what's what you're attracting. All right. And let's get right to it, Leo. So please only take what fits, what resonates and makes sense for you. Whatever doesn't, just leave it on out. It may be a message for someone else. Let's get right into this, Leo. I missed you guys. Let's see what we have here. Love reading for Leo. Okay. All right, here we go. All right, so seeing a lot of healing here. We have temperance. All right, this is Sagittarius. This is all about healing. This is all about inner calm, balance, really focusing on making sure that things around you are centered, making sure that you feel good, right? That you're okay. Looking out for yourself here. There's also this slow movement here. So you may be in a situation where you want to slow things down and you may be wanting to focus on you. All right, we have the King of Pentacles here. This is Taurus energy. You have Virgo here as well, Leo. Yeah, it feels like right now you guys are really trying to take time for you. Putting yourself first. You may have been dealing with a Taurus here. Uh, I feel like you really just want... It's like you're wanting someone here who can reciprocate, someone who's going to put time and effort into you, but you feel like you need to slow things down. You may feel like you need to take a look at certain things here. There may be some drama, some gossip here. It's like someone's just not taking things too serious. There's certain information that you may have learned here that's making you really ha have to think a little bit deeper about where you want this to go, about the road that you're headed down. Some of you may also be feeling like it's been a very hard road uh, with the situation or relationship that you're in. Okay, I definitely feel like there's a lot that's going to come to light here, like a lot of information that's going to be given here, but definitely someone who's jealous or envious here as well. Drama, gossip. Oh, goodness. Okay. Let's take a little, let's, let's get a little bit more here about this, okay? We're going to take a deeper look, Leo. Okay. All right. Someone feels entitled. Someone feels like they should have what they want here. But I feel like this is a time for you uh, where you're putting your wants and needs first and you're letting go of the drama. It's like you're taking control here, Leo. You're ready to have fun. You're ready to do your thing. You're not going to deal with any immaturity. You're not going to deal with any pettiness. You're not going to deal with, okay, like don't bring your mess to me. That's what it feels like. Giving that person the full stop. I'm not dealing with it. I feel like a lot of you are ready to branch out, travel, try new things, see new places, starting a business, a lot going on here, a lot to maintain, a lot to balance. I also see a lot of success here for you when it comes to putting you first and focusing on the things that you care about the most. Okay. What else for Leo? Yeah, you're walking away, separating yourself from a turbulent relationship. It's always very up and down, a lot of a lack of peace, really. So I feel like this is what's really important to you. Peace of mind. OK, it feels like there's a lot that you're carrying with you when it comes to this relationship or again, situation, whatever situation you're in, Leo. Yeah, it feels like you're just ready to release it. You're letting go. OK, you also have Leo here. So let's get more, okay, into your person now. Oh, okay. All right. All right, so we have the Emperor here. We have the World, Queen of Cups. You have Aries, Scorpio, Aquarius, Taurus, and Leo. Someone doesn't know what they want. Someone's trying to keep things the way they are. They want to keep it going. They're repeating the same mistakes, the same patterns here. They do feel entitled. They feel like they should have what they want the way they want it. This is someone who is very, very into what they have. It's all about them. It's all about what they can receive from others, from you. But they're confused, feeling separated, 
feeling like their world is spinning. Leo, my goodness. This person's thinking a lot about you and about the situation. There's a separation. Yeah, it's definitely giving this person a lot of time to think. Now, for some of you, it may be this person who can't make up their mind. So they've separated here. They've decided to separate. They feel stuck. Okay, there's a lot going on here. A lot going on. A lot in the mix. They just don't know what they want. See, there's that up and down. There's that up and down. We have more cycles here. Mm -hmm. At a crossroads, they're not making a, a, a clear decision, but they know they need to. Now it's almost like they have no choice. They don't know what to do. They don't see a way out. Okay, someone may be in a situation here and they're looking for a way out, but it's hard to see a way out, Leo. This person does. It's like they feel like they've put themselves themselves in a really bad position here. They have a lot going on and it's not easy. Like this person is really stressed. All right, let's get a little bit more here. So you have Pisces, okay? Pisces joining here. What else? Thank you. All right, so what you're attracting here, happiness, a good time. I do feel like there's going to be answers here that you've been seeking. For some of you, you may have been feeling like you know the answer already and you have it, it's there. Uh, really paying attention to it, moving forward, your intuition. Yeah, a new beginning, especially from an ending, okay? From an ending or separation comes a new beginning, but it's also like you're clearing your energy here. Clearing your energy of the same old thing, right? It's tiring. It's exhausting. You're ready for calm. You're ready for that balance, right? You're ready for that peace of mind, but also fun and excitement. That's what you have here. I feel like you're going to be really prepared for what this person is going to do. Like, it's like there's something that they, a way they always act, certain things they always say. It's almost like you see it coming. You expect it and you know how to handle it. And that's part of the strength here. That's part of that taking time to think, especially for those of you who may have just gone through the separation or breakup, that time alone, giving you that process, right? That time to think, giving you that clarity here. It's like, you're going to be ready for it. You have such great strength here. Sticking up for what you want, defending yourself. I love it. Focusing on new energy here, new love coming in, soulmate energy, two people who are meant to come together, two people who are ready for that exchange, right? That reciprocation that we were talking about, Leo. Woo, yes, love it. You're attracting new love. You're attracting new love. Loyalty. Someone who can be loyal, someone you can depend on. Uh, now, be aware of someone who always tries to come back or tries to be playful and take things as a joke, take things lightly, like they can't be serious here. This person always wants to come back, even when things get really crazy, really tense, uh, kind of explode in a sense. This person always tells you that they want to work it out. They want to come together. They want to focus on the family. They want to focus on being happy with you, but it feels like you are really looking at everything here the bigger picture here leo and that's what's so important the bigger picture and your happiness letting go of that stress that worry realizing right that the process when we go through those endings the breakups right to get to the beautiful new beginning it isn't easy it can be really tough but focusing on what you still have you focusing on your happiness, focusing on your strength, that's where that point should be. That's where you should be focused. That's where you should be looking up, not down, moving forward. So important here when it comes to having this type of energy and you have it because this is what you're attracting. Okay. No matter what your story or where you're at now, this is what you're attracting. Beautiful love here, a new beginning. And I talked about peace, right? We talked about a lot of peace, emotions overflowing, but they're good, but they're happy. All good vibes. This is what you're attracting. So let's see. Okay. Someone here doesn't want to, it's like they don't want to let go. They don't want to give up. Someone here is going to make an offer. They're coming through with an offer. Your soul is preparing to reconnect. Leo, trust 
in the process. Trust yourself. Trust your intuition. Okay, I, I, I pulled both of these. I'm going to read them. You have feelings here. Take time out to explore the deep emotions that you're feeling because it does feel like a roller coaster. It feels like it's been a wild ride. But with this, you have enlightenment. Okay, there is no separation when we recognize that we are one with the divine. We are one with light. We're all one with each other. There's so much potential, so many opportunities, so many blessings. All is possible. Beautiful things that you can recognize, right? It's kind of like a wake-up call, right? It's tough at first, like I was saying, but what comes through in the end, so much more um, enlightening, so much more intense, and all those good vibes, Leo. So let's look on the bottom here. Uh, emotions, look deep within your emotions. That keeps coming through here. A lot to process, a lot to look into, a lot to face, a lot to feel, a lot to work out. But the beautiful new relationship, new beginning here, being free, being happy, celebrating, having a good time, right? This is all about the harvest here. This is what you're attracting. Someone here who you're coming together with, right? Beautiful energy. That magnetism, that spark, that fire. Okay. There's going to be beautiful power here, a beautiful connection here. Two souls being drawn together. Let's get a little bit more. Okay. For Leo, please. Okay. Leo. Oh, I love it. So much here about power, right? Strength. Looking deep. All right. Empowered love. Harness your strength and love with confidence. You have charm, solid, steady. Know that you are solid. Know that you deserve something steady. Know that you deserve someone who wants to be steady with you. This is the time for that enlightenment. This is the time for you to feel empowered and go with it, rock with it. Know yourself and what you want. And all is possible. And you will achieve so much here when it comes to experiencing that love where you're drawn to each other like a magnet. Okay. Taking a leap forward, seize the moment and let yourself be loved fully. There's movement here, speed, making progress, taking those leaps. All right, taking those leaps, hops forward into a new beginning, into that fun, into that excitement. Things are going to happen in the right time, okay? Have faith and wait until you find the right one. Hold on, self-love and things happening soon. See the clocks there? Have faith, so important. All right. I feel like when you meet this person here, this new person that comes in, it's going to be hard to slow it down because it's going to be really intense, right? Feeling empowered, feeling ready, confident. Queen of Wands is all about that energy, being really confident, knowing what you want, not playing any games. <laughs> okay. Ever after, having the fortitude to create a lasting love, long-term, someone who is all in. This is what I'm talking about. Someone who's ready to invest, right? That power we have here on this table, solid, steady, ready. This is how you and this person will come together. Happily ever after. This is the vision. This is the dream. This is the focus. Things are going to start to come around here. Hoping for another chance and wanting to try again. Someone is living with regrets. Someone may want to reconcile. This may only be for some of you out there. But someone here may uh, recognize what they're losing when it comes to you, the person that you are. And they want to come back around. But if it's not giving you this, the happily ever after... If it's not real and you're not seeing that effort, I feel like you're not dealing with it because this is what you have coming to you. You're focused on something that is meant for you. 
someone who's going to put in, right? Who can provide what you deserve, what's needed. So let's see. Putting in that time. Putting in that effort. That's what makes this energy here, Leo, so solid and steady. I also feel like there's someone here who's going to be really charming on a whole another level. <laughs> okay, let's see. All right, now we have unfaithful here. Another lover in the mix. Someone is horning in. There may be a partner here that you may be feeling you can't trust. Some of you may be starting to see the bigger picture here and you're like, wait a minute. Uh -uh, this isn't this isn't who I thought this person is like you're really starting to see clear now. OK, you're starting to see through the games. The control someone here is insecure. And acting out this person needs a lot of reassurance. It's like they it's like. They're way too insecure and it may be causing issues here. You have passionate on the bottom. There's that two of cups. There's that magnetism and intense attraction, hot and heavy at first. All right. Now you guys, some of you may be in a situation where this person just wants physical relationship. There's nothing deeper here. There's nothing more here. And if that's what you want, fine. But again, there's a lot of passion here, but again, someone here may have someone else in the mix and they're just, it's like they're throwing mixed signals here. Or you're starting to feel like, okay, something is a little off. Okay, it's like it's very mysterious, like they're very, there it is, very secretive, okay, very mysterious, very secretive, there's a lot going on, okay, hiding who they are, not the whole truth, may have a side piece, someone is taking their space, someone may be distancing from you because they're playing games here, so again, please only take what fits for you. All right, let's take a, let's take a closer look here, one more for Leo. Peace. Yes. Love it. Staying calm, staying balanced, focusing on you. That peace and patience. So important. And this is what's coming. This is what you deserve. Some of you who are taking your space, separating yourself and focusing on your peace. There's success there. Don't give up. Don't stop. Keep doing what you know and you feel is right for you because what you're doing is building. Here's the building blocks here. You're taking those leaps, right? Taking those leaps, taking those steps into your new beginning. Funny how things can just align and the path kind of creates itself, but you're the one that has to take those steps to get there. Okay. All right. Now also know, all right, spirit's telling you there is a change in the wind. Okay. There's going to be a switch up here. You might need to change your course, right? With certain things that are revealed, certain things you're feeling, certain things you're seeing. Don't ignore that because that change, that new course is where you're meant to be taking those steps along the way there may be a lot here that you're questioning or someone may be questioning why like why is this happening what's going on but i feel like this is going to be a time where a lot is going to be revealed a lot's going to be really uh, eye opening but in the end it's like this this empowering feeling and emotions when it comes to love and it comes to your confidence it comes to your strength willed it hold on to it rock it don't let it go all right do you don't be afraid of that change in the wind. There's only peace here and building so much more, right? Okay, Leo, that's what I have for you. Thank you so much, you guys, for watching. Please like, subscribe. Don't forget to uh, hit that bell. Do all those wonderful things. So happy to be back. I missed you guys. I will see you in the next video. Love you all. Bye.